Hey everyone, recently I cleared my KCNA exam and in this video I am going to tell you how to prepare for exam, what resources to use and my personal tips to clear your exam. So hey everyone, I am Kavilya Koparkar, I make content around DevOps, DevRel and open source ecosystem. So let's get started. So what is KCNA? So KCNA stands for Kubernetes and Cloud Native Associate exam and which is official exam by CNCF and Linux Foundation. So this certification is uh, tagged as pre-professional certification. This certification is specifically designed for professionals who want to showcase their knowledge about Kubernetes and Cloud Native ecosystem. This certification particularly helps students or beginners who want to get started with cloud native uh, ecosystem and showcase their knowledge in a really great and professional manner. So having a KCNA certification demonstrates that you have a very good and uh, fundamental knowledge about Kubernetes and cloud native ecosystem. And in the, this course covers a wide uh, variety of uh, aspects into cloud native ecosystem so uh, i would highly encourage you to uh, take this exam and get that certification because uh, while preparing myself i found out the topics that were in the curriculum were really helpful and really helped me understand kubernetes and cloud native ecosystem in depth uh, much more uh, nicely so uh, we will get into curriculum and everything about uh, specifics about uh, certification in a short while this exam is mcq based exam which is conducted in 90 minutes so you have 90 minutes to solve 60 mcq questions and the passing grade you need to get to get the certificate is 75 percent so even though this exam is mcq based as i said earlier you need a really good understanding of kubectl commands uh, how things uh, work inside networking and stuff and we will see the curriculum as well as it is mentioned uh, in the official curriculum so this certificate will really help you in your professional journey and if, if you are a student this would really highlight your resume uh, uh, with a lot because the interviewer will be really able to see your professional efficiency and uh, as the certification is conducted by uh, cncf under uh really strict proctoration so that that is a huge plus for your authenticity of your exam as well so let's go ahead and see the curriculum and all the course details so we are on official uh, kcna website so as you can see uh, kubernetes and cloud native associate exam uh, which uh, as of now is 250 dollars so, uh, this is uh, this might feel a lot uh, and it is a lot to be honest but uh, if you are a student then there are multiple opportunities where you can get this certification for uh, very cheap or uh, free as well sometimes so stick around uh, till the end to find out how you can get this uh, certification for really minimal cost or free as well so let's move ahead so you can enroll for uh, the uh, certification here and you can purchase the bundles as well so you get like two three certifications as a bundle for really cheap uh, that is also an option here so as i mentioned earlier uh, there is a information about who is it for and about the certification what it demonstrates so you can uh, read through this and understand uh, the certification uh, about more about the certification and as you can see this uh, is uh, online and the certification is valid for three years uh, so as the uh, Kubernetes uh, is like highly evolving and there are multiple tools in cloud native ecosystem and the concepts keep on uh, getting updated as uh, with new versions. So only th uh, this certification is only valid for three years and you will have to take a re-examination after three years includes 12 month exam eligibility like once you register for the exam uh, like once you purchase uh, this exam you have to take the exam in uh, 12 months so like in one year and one retake is uh, available so if you take the exam and if you fail by any chance then you get one free retake for the exam which you can take uh, by preparing yourself again and it is a multiple choice question exam as i said earlier and the duration of the exam is 90 minutes uh moving ahead then you can see the course uh 
like the ratings and stuff it is really good uh, then we move ahead uh, with the domains and uh, competencies so uh, as you can see the uh, there are like this is like curriculum so kubernetes fundamentals con container orchestration contain uh, cloud native architecture cloud native ob observability cloud native app application delivery this is there and what is this percentage so this percentage is, is like a weightage to the section so you can understand what is the importance uh, what is what are the important sections uh, in this certification and uh, what is the weightage you will be getting the questions upon and what are the sections you should be giving your most time while preparation so first is kubernetes fundamentals and in this you will understand the kubernetes resources kubernetes architecture kubernetes api containers and scheduling so uh, trust me these are the this certification is designed so well that you will go through each and every step uh, one by one and understand kubernetes in depth and in a really easy manner and i will share the resources and stuff uh, uh, as well so this is uh, in the kubernetes fundamentals and it is like 46 percent of importance so uh, you should really give good time for this then there comes container orchestration in this you will understand container orchestration fundamentals what is container runtime container securities networking what are service meshes uh, storage so as you can see a lot of buzzwords and you will be learning all of them uh, during this course after that uh, you will uh, also learn about cloud native architecture so auto scaling what are serverless then community and governance like what how is cncf distributed and how cncf governs what is the cncf hierarchy well, like you hear about uh, sigs uh, in kubernetes community and all this stuff what are all these and what hierarchy they fall under and everything like that after that you will understand roles and personas and open standards uh, then you will learn about cloud native observability where is telemetry and observability uh, you might have heard about prometheus i have a video about prometheus on my youtube channel so while preparing if you want you can take uh, see watch the video and get a like a hands on experience with uh, prometheus that might help you with your exam uh, and cost management uh, as like cost management is really important <laughs> and you don't want to stay up your bills right so after that you will uh, learn about a cloud native application delivery so application fundamentals what is gitops what is cicd so you will extensively uh, learn about it and uh, get a hands-on uh, up as well so again i have a gitops video about argo cd on my channel if while learning if you want you can check that out as well and yeah i will share uh, one of the announcements at the end of the video so please make sure you stick uh, till the end uh, and and yeah that was all about the certification so i will link this uh, website down in the description box as always and you can go there check out enroll now that we have uh, seen all about uh, the certification let's uh, go ahead and see the resources you can follow the first resource uh, and uh, most of you uh, people will suggest this as well this is exam pro uh, the website called exam pro there is entire video of like i guess 14 hours or something like that on free code camp channel uh, which is again by andrew and he teaches uh, really uh, amazingly and in proper depth about this so uh, either you can go ahead and see the free code camp uh, cha youtube channel directly or andrews or exam pro channel directly the the videos are same it is the same uh, just be uh, i am suggesting you to go and just register it is a free it this is website is free and uh, not is, uh, nothing is endorsed or promoted in this uh, video so but i i really i followed this you can see i followed this uh, myself so i'm showing it to you so uh this is like distributed really well so introduction exam guide uh and then you can go what is cloud native and step by step and complete them uh and stuff and if you want then uh you can go ahead and see you can uh, get like a premium version where you will get all the cheat sheets flashcards study notes and stuff i got i did all my notes myself so i did not take uh, i did not upgrade i you uh, i leveraged the, the free version of the website so uh, this you can go and at the end you get one free exam uh, free practice exam with uh, 60 questions and 90 minutes so before exam like two days before or one day before exam you can actually go ahead and take the practice exam to uh, see uh, how you are able to perform in that 
uh, and yeah you can go ahead and uh, use this platform the second resource is my personal notes so yes i have my personal notes which you can find on notes.kavilikoparkar.com actually there are multiple notes on uh, notes.kavilikoparkar.com but if you just uh, add ls dot, uh, slash kcn you will be redirected to kcn events uh, so uh, these are kcn notes again there are the same ones uh, as i mentioned but the thing is every diagram in these notes are drawn by me so they are not just uh, drag and drop from internet uh, one one two are uh, there uh, where which like the diagrams on internet were much more clearer so i wanted to make it clearer for you all so uh, that's why uh, i picked one two images but others are uh, like drawn by me and all the notes are they are not like uh, again they are not copy pasted they are all written by myself while following the course itself so you can find everything there so if you just go ccncf essential is there kubernetes overview is there uh, and if you want to see the custom drawn ones so maybe if you go here see uh, such diagrams are drawn personally by me to make you understand uh, what is going on so if you are learning about container runtime uh, the important points are here so you can use these notes as kind of a revision so i would highly recommend you to go ahead uh, do the course take out your own notes and then go through my notes to do a quick revision about important points diagrams and re uh, reenacting your learning maybe you can say so uh, if you go ahead and see there are uh, networking is one of my favorite uh, topics and uh, i am very proud of myself for drawing uh, good diagrams in here to make you understand about uh, the topic so yeah please go ahead and if you like it please do share my notes with others and uh i i would like my notes to reach out as much as many people as uh possible so even if you are not taking exam you can leverage my notes to uh learn and understand that is the end goal as always so yeah that are my notes uh then uh, all notes are there as per the uh, as, as as per the course so you can go ahead and check that out uh, so like yeah again like it's like a quick revision if you want to great uh, the third uh, resource is uh, the KCN study group this is like the most recent you can say and uh, uh, this is a, a github repository cleared, uh, created by James uh, one of my good friends so you can go ahead and uh, check this out where if you go to the discussions you will find out uh, there are discussions going on do introduce yourself here and go on to uh, all these like discussions ask your questions get your answers help others like use this platform prove to be a really great resource for you while preparing for your kcna exam and yeah you can check your polls q a and stuff it is like it is it it is going to be a really great resource for uh, every kcna learner and this has been like a uh, one to two days it has been launched so as soon as you get the video please go ahead and give the star i am not signed in uh, i have already given the star here but yeah let's go ahead uh, then the third resource is my blog so i have recently published my blogs on uh, cracking your uh, kcna exam so it's it's similar that uh, how you can uh, like prepare what is kcna the ev everything i'm telling in this video here but if you want to go and quick uh, get a quick uh, transcript of this video you can say then you can just go here and quickly i have uh, again linked all the resources here uh, whatever i'm sharing and conclusion and stuff the tips i have uh, shared here are here and then there is another blog by brad uh, if you are already into community and uh, you know brad a uh, really great person sharing lot of tips and lot of information and guy always guiding students and student communities so this blog is by brad how to pass your case in exam and brad really really uh, greatly mentioned uh, all the tips that i mentioned already but uh, like uh, some of them are really uh, like a bit personal uh, from personal experience of his so that is really great uh, uh, opportunities and here uh, he has mentioned every see he has mentioned the resources as well the community uh, and what you can follow what are the more like important points uh, in the curriculum like in under every section what are the uh, important points you should be focusing and uh, the resources are uh, attached here and again this is really great and study tips are given exam day tips are given i i read through this uh, before my exam and uh, this were really really helpful 
helpful so i will again link this blog down uh, and please give uh, this blog uh, appreciation comment uh, that it was helpful brad would appreciate that that you are liking the blog so uh, because i am sharing i really liked it so you should also go ahead and at least appreciate that you are reading it and if you uh, felt it useful uh, please give the blog appreciation brad has written uh, multiple uh, different blogs as well uh, on kc and ckd which are like uh, further like after uh, kcna you can do these exams as well uh, which are professional level exam and can uh, uh, will definitely help you in your professional journey and uh, other things so you can definitely go ahead and check out brad's blogging site yeah we can cover the tips now so tips uh, can be get as many as much hands-on practice as you can uh, and uh, by that what i mean is even though the exam is uh, mcq best uh, the questions are highly focused on on your experience right so uh, it's not like the uh, mcq exam we give in, in our college uh, and stuff this is much more on like a personal level so uh, if you have a hands on experience you will be able to quickly get the answers in your head so whatever topic you are learning go ahead and get a hands on experience and uh, m many of the videos are there on my youtube channel again uh, you can check that out if you want uh, and uh, yeah there is a small announcement at the end of this video as i said then give yourself an enough time to understand again uh this is uh again if even if it's like theory theoretical give yourself good time to understand and run a uh, same uh, concept through your head three to five times i would say uh and that would be uh, again less too but yeah go through documentation and stuff yeah and again you can reach out to people in the community to guide you uh, you can join the community from the <laughs> link in the description as well so try to deep dive so uh whatever topic you are learning it's always good practice to deep dive and experiment around stuff uh break stuff build stuff and and that's how you will learn so don't uh, only go on surface level go into depth and understand and see what you can do different things with the same technology then solve as many mock exams as possible there is one mock exam i told you about there are multiple github repositories and if you want i will link them into description as well and uh, if you join community i can uh, share you the community link will be in description so just ping me in the community and i will share you the mock test uh, uh, repos where you can take mock tests for free uh, and as many as you want and that is pretty much uh, it for this video uh, and uh, for coming back to the announcement as I said so you already have the notes and resources I shared and stuff but I will be creating videos uh, on every topic uh, from the notes and stuff uh, to like give you like much more personalized experience to the learning so if you want to like if you have started learning please go ahead check the youtube channel this video will be in a playlist called kcna preparation so go ahead and uh, mark the playlist or something and if you want subscribe to the channel so you can get the notification uh, and uh, i will be posting videos on each and every topic explaining the concept in depth but in simplicity and in like very shortly so you get you grasp the concept really well and don't get confused so that is my one of the like uh, plans to help you all out with kcna exam and build a content around kcna so you get uh, like focused learning as you want so yeah go ahead and check out and if you like this video please give this uh, a like and if you want you can subscribe to the channel the you can also join my discord community the link will be in the description where you can ask questions about kcna and other certifications there are many professionals there who already have these certifications which would really like to help you all uh, during your preparation or in general in your learnings so please make sure you join the community if you want and share this video if you liked it and i will see you in the next one